lot of situations happening too. Oh yeah, okay. So, so in those pieces, M insured is uh, insured state. We uh, oversee about 2,500 people within M insured. That's navigators. I don't know if you guys are familiar with navigators. Navigators are the folks that are people on the ground registering community members and residents. Um, and they speak all sorts of languages. We have Somali, Spanish, Korean, whatever it might be. Navigators are on the ground making sure that people are getting registered. On that second piece is that um, we also have our website that's pretty not as user friendly right now, and that's exactly what we've been working on. And um, we also have um, what a large team of um, a litigation department and policy, which is what they're working on every day. They're on they're in DC on every week trying to get some more answers to anything that might be coming up in the future. So I guess one of the questions is what the problems are. You know, and I think for a lot of our programs and our systems, it's really asking ourselves, what are we doing for communities? And are we making sure we're meeting those lines? Um, I can tell you right now that our website is probably not the most user friendly. These are things that we're working on a daily trying to make sure that it works in the way that's for everyone. And that's breaking down some barriers and that's easy. Um, getting some more funding when it comes to our navigate, making sure that people are getting registered. We've got about almost a million people that are registered right now to come insure. Um, any kind of concerns or problems, whatever that might be, that we actually have a response for that. And it's not a generated message that says, hey, you know, life sucks. We're so sorry. Where it actually has a reasoning why this is happening and what we're going to do in the future to correct anything that you're working on. Um, what can we make things to be more equitable? Language and translation has a big, a big deal. Um, and then also, uh, one thing that's coming up in the pipeline right now is making sure that the immigration pieces are being taken care of, that people feel safe that they're able to apply for insurance and their information is not going to be sent off to different departments and other things that will keep happening from there. Um, and making sure that people's privacies are still being kept and met within an insurer, which is exactly what we're doing right now. And our governor behind us, there you go, also backs us up as much as we can too. Um, I, we would love to be able to start applying to more grants and more foundations in order for us to keep making sure that that reach, especially in our urban areas and the rural areas, is being met as well. Because I think when it comes to having more information, we could probably do a better job, especially in our rural areas. So, there you go.